Okay, so, uh, can we get out of here now? This place is starting to smell. Yeah, I don't like the misery. That's it! Turn the dark world! Sorry. This was not- this was not the Ooh. best option. Hey! Oh. I ran here! Did I scare you? <laughs> oh my god, the broom can talk! So, uh, uh, thanks for helping me. And this whole thing about me, uh, being a sage, some kind of special girl? Wow, big surprise. Well, I wish I could leave where I am now, but, uh, I'll have to keep sending my broom. I'm hungry. Oh. <laughs> you know, I really miss my Graham. Can't wait to see her again. You know, someday we should visit old Graham Graham, see if maybe she misses her granddaughter, and... Hey, Mr. Hero! Welcome! So have uh, you been using that quick equip uh, technique I told you about a ways back? Out. No, I, I, I have been. Uh, yeah, yeah, totally! Well, keep it up! I actually got another quick equip tip for you. Was that? That's so out. See the slider on the item selection screen? E no. Uh, oh, yeah, I see it now. Oh, that You guessed it. it! You can slide to the left or to the right. Might take you a look at the lower screen. Three hops this time. Beep, See how the size beep, of the blue beep, beep. frame is changing? That shows how many items you have ready for quick equip. Cha -cha, real smooth. Uh. For example, <laughs> let's say you want only the items you use the most to show up in the quick equip. Oh. In that case, set the slider to the far right to highlight just four items, and then put your fave four there. That's actually not a bad tip there. But yeah. if you want to have more than four items in quick equip, just move the slider toward the left. Okay. Am I the only one that doesn't find this all that useful? I never I, I, fucking I, used it. Me I was, I'm sorry. I'm going. A, I'm going to go on a rant about this. Don't. If you want to organize, if you want to organize the fucking items, just organize the fucking items. <laughs> it's they're, they're thinking of people who don't want to be using the touchscreen all the time and just use the buttons. Logan, Logan, I am a man whose favorite aspect of the Resident Evil series is the fucking attaché case from four. I will y organize my fucking equipment. Would you? So you're telling me that you would absolutely pay money and would love to play a Zelda game that had an attaché case system? Yeah, actually, it'd be fun. Breath of the Wild 2, maybe. There's, there, Logan. You're the one who literally showed me a game in the past, uh, uh, an indie game. An I indie forgot game the name. that is just nothing. That's, it's an indie game that was just nothing but a Tache case. It's literally just a fucking Tache case. I'm j and I'm just saying, like, they should totally make a Tetris spinoff where it's all about organizing Tache case. <laughs> actually, that is what yeah, the game yeah. is. Yeah, I mean, I'll, look, I'll look up. Yeah, I'll look up what the game was called. Cause it's been a while since I played it. But, but, but in any case, while while we look that up, uh, I will say. So, James, what is on our agenda today? The lack of buying the wind rod pisses me off. It's be fine. Okay. So, with that being said, it's gonna be a little ways before we reach our next dungeon. However. Oh. Oh, that's right. Jordan. Uh, Jordan. Oh, yeah, you're really wearing out my poor little broom. You better buy me a new one. Otherwise, <laughs> uh. How will I give you more rides? How are you going to try it? anything? You can't do nothing. Yeah, yeah, you can't do nothing. You hear me? Nothing. Nothing, yeah. whatever. I'm untouchable. Unless you wear. My, my. I saw it first. And it's just such a cool gloves. There you are. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah, you respond. Okay, there you go. More my mice for Sealy. You okay, buddy? <laughs> sure, I'll be make, okay. Just making sure. The surefire side of a broken. Oh, hello there, Chancellor. I almost forgot you were still oh, here. Hey, Chancellor. Oh, After the freeze. second quake, strange cracks thinking appear. Of Chancellor Colton's it must have some course. connection to mm. what has happened. I can do nothing, I'm afraid, but hope for peace to be restored to us. Actually, not going That's to lie. That's a mighty fine not painting, going, though. Not going to lie, he looks like Chevy Chase. I feel like making him sound like an asshole. <laughs> oh, I, no. I don't know. You don't have to do that. Hey, how, uh, what's up, Seely? You're thinking of Chancellor Cole from uh, Spirit Tracks. Ah, <gasps> oh, light! How long has it been since I knew such a comfort? And oh, now this one's not the priest, but the philosopher. Oh. Three years or eternity. The world outside has long darkened with the menace of the mask. I don't even know what Chevy Chase sounds like. I'm just doing whatever fucking voice I can. That's fine. <sighs> well, there's fine. a little light against a rising dark. Also, that pillar is going to hit me. No one honors yes, the gods is. anymore. So beware, child. The end is at By hand. Now, if you excuse By me, God, I'm going to right. go... Oh, now, oh, he just barely dodged it. Now, if you excuse oh. me... Oh, sorry. 
Nobody bothers coming to this place anymore, but even I must wonder, have we abandoned the gods? Or have they abandoned us? Now if you excuse me, I'm going to go piss off an entire cast for four seasons before I'm written off. Okay. Duly noted. Hey, uh, I'm gonna take my I boing stick. I... Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking I might go for now if the temperature is going up and I feel just sick. Ooh, um, I will ask Seely real quick. Would you mind stick, sticking around for at least a few, just one more minute? Because uh, w w wise words of wisdom are about to be popped up by you know who, by oh. Hilda. But then, yeah, we absolutely hey. understand you taking a break after Welcome that. Welcome back to Laurel Kingdom, the Queen. Ah, uh, she got that voice spray. Mm -hmm. Where you stand now was once a holy place. Now it could not be further away from such a thing. However, nearby sleeps something that will help you on your journey. A thorough search will behoove you. And I never knew that was a word. Me neither. Yeah, so say I, Hilda of yeah, And with I, that, Hilda is going to go get her much needed rest. That's what we like. Yes, I nice. love rest. I love rest every. Up, I on a side note, I've been sick. My voice is back to normal now. Okay. All right. Yay. You sound weird when you're. You sounded really weird when you were sick. Anyway, uh. <laughs> yeah, you sound. Yeah, you sounded like freaking, uh. Miss. Uh, Satchmo. Is that, but yeah, no, okay, but but, but but I will interrupt Matt real quick and say, yeah, by all means now, see, now that's some, please, like, go, like, get water, ice, yeah. and cool off. Yeah, I have water on me, but the thing is, it's not helping. It's cool I have no air conditioning in this room. It's stuck in here. I can't open my window. Go someplace so that has air conditioning. Someone bring the fans and fan the little Pichu. I, I don't know where to go that has air conditioning. You could go to, I don't know, a... Starbucks, any coffee shop, a uh, library, any place. Just bring your computer, do stuff there, maybe bring your Switch. You'll do fine. But yeah. Yeah, no. But by all means, just so if you have to get going, don't worry yeah, about it. Yeah, go ahead, yeah. hon. We can, we can hold down the fort from here, Lucis. Alright. I'll see you guys there, then I'll save my audio. Alright, bye bye. 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 See ya, Hilda. But yeah, just going back real quick, Logan, I have to agree, that, that voice spray that she borrowed from Bugs really helped. <laughs> but yeah, no, uh, Still on that. Yeah, and, and meanwhile, James is doing pretty good on the My Mike collection. We're almost done with this part of the world. It's like I... this weird island bit. Oh, Die. you know what? You mentioned that. I I'm trying to remember. Was Jordan with us when we did any of like the My My returning stuff? No, I don't believe uh, we have. She was. I think no. there was. I think there was one part where you mentioned the My Mice. Well, I meant like when we were when we started returning them to the mother. Oh, she she hasn't met the mother yet. Oh no, I've okay. never met the mother. No. <laughs> okay. Do we see the mother at any point in this part? I do not know. It has it has been I'll, a little while since I recorded this footage. See ahead. Actually, now All that right. I think about it, it's actually it's almost been two years since I recorded this footage. Wow. Oof. Yeah, we've been sitting on this for a while. Like like I said before, I actually recorded this before we did our. Um, Link's Awakening Switch uh, stuff, but uh, we just it just we kind of decided early on that technically it does it does take place after Link to the Past, so we figured we'll just do that first and then do this afterwards. Mm -hmm. Could it be you can see no pay? I mean, you do stick out. <laughs> what was soul is spoken to don't be for so long? Don't be so bones I need a falling apart. It's been so long. Don't be used to be the gravekeeper here, but now there aren't any graves to keep. Look at him. Was it something the graves were protecting? Don't be can't even remember. Can I actually point something out? What's up? This is the only character whose counterpart has the same name as the original. The oh, only you're right. one. Mild difference though, there is a question mark next to his name. Yeah, but he did mm. say that his name is Dompe, so. I mean, Dude. that's what he's saying, but it's been so long he probably forgot his real name. His name is actually Pedom. I was gonna say no. He, I, I thought his name was gonna be Frappe. I'm going to call well, him. The thing is, I'm going to call him Bizarro. Bizarro. Be a mild man, to, be a mild man to reporter, not Bizarro. Not Bizarro. That's look actually over there. That's actually. Quick, I love there. I, I love that <laughs> one. It just goes like, not Bizarro. I have to turn into alter ego Bizarro. Quick, look over there. Over there. It's like, Superman went for a robot into sun. Me do the opposite. Me throw sun oh, into just... robot. Ow, 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 ow. Superman would punch robot. Me do be opposite. Kick it! Ding! 
<laughs> also, I love the, uh, everybody knows it's you, Bizarro. Hey, not Bizarro, looking good. Everybody Everyone but Jimmy. Everyone but Jimmy knows. <laughs> You're Jimmy. Poor Jimmy. Poor Jimmy. <laughs> oh, God damn it. Left with a... You actually know the video. What am I thinking? I could just go in here and grab the yeah. piece of art. I, I have to... Okay. We have to show you that, by the way, Jordy. It is one of the funniest, like, shorts that, uh... That DC's might have made, been DC yeah. ever made. But here, here's the one thing as well that I'm going to say about <laughs> DC. I... My favorite thing with the character of Bizarro is when they don't make him a villain. I like that. Because the thing is... Yeah. Yes, he is the opposite of Superman, but the opposite of Superman doesn't mean that he's evil. He's just misguided. Yeah, yeah. basically. He, he, he's he's just... basically a giant man-child with heat vision. Yeah. Yeah. It's why I, I hope, like, if we ever get a DCEU version, they don't just make him straight up a bad guy. I kind of want them to do what they did with uh, the Red Sun version of Bizarro, which is my favorite version. Like, it is a fantastic uh... version. You got a light? There you go. No, I mean yes. <laughs> so yeah, pretty much, pretty much mirroring what we were doing in the uh, sanctuary last time. Uh, wow, real! What uh... a splendid treasure that is. <laughs> I'm sure it's someone's treasure. But yeah, no, pretty much mirroring what we did in the very beginning of the game. We're heading into the underground depths of Low Rule Sanctuary to see if there's anything worth pickpocketing. Oh, but uh, I had a little bit. Oh, sorry. Sorry. By the way, last thing I'll uh, say really quick. By the way, pe to people watching, Bizarro from the, uh, I mean Bizarro from the Red Sun comic. Completely different from the Bizarro of the Red Sun movie. I fucking hate the Red Sun movie. Because they made uh, him a bad guy? They they not only made him a straight up bad guy, but they took the one, like, my favorite scene from the comic and just decided, eh, let's not do it. Just, just not. Straight up. Aw, I'm sorry. Uh, hey, Logan, what are your thoughts on Mr. Bizarro? As in, like, Superman Bizarro, right? Yes, yeah, we've been uh, talking yeah. about talking him about. this whole time. Yeah, I don't care much about that. I, I was thinking, like, primarily... I think he works as an anti... I mean, to me, he worked better as, like, being... I don't like... Sometimes I, I don't care for his portrayal as being a dumb Superman. Like, a bulky, just me. Like, I, I you know, a Mongo kind of, like... Guy, Mongo only. Well, the, yeah, thing about in game the, the only thing, the, right? The only thing that the only bit of bizarre that I do remember, like really enjoying, was that fan animation, the the, the fan like full drawn, hand drawn animation bit where they had the cool little sound design thing that I haven't seen done before. Uh, the cool sound design tip of having his dialogue literally be reversed audio. Yeah, that that I saw the animation too. It's amazing. Um. But I will say, like, the the whole thing of Bizarro, I just don't like oh. when they make him... Oh, jeez! Oh. oh, boy. I don't like when they just make him another evil Superman. Because, again, I am fucking sick to death with Isn't evil Bizarro Superman's World supposed to be, like, just anti-anything? So he's, he, literally is a, he's, he literally is the sci-fi definition of being an evil Superman? No. Well, no, basically, the thing with Bizarro is that, like, he's the opposite of Superman in a lot of regards, but he's also kind of simple-minded like he's not really aware of the damage he causes and that and huh. that's why I like yes you might complain oh that just makes him dumb superman it doesn't though it really doesn't um, i mean he's pretty what he's pretty much to dc as big the cat is to sonic he's not really stupid just simple-minded yeah, yeah. you know that's actually a pretty a pretty uh spot-on comparison there james yeah yeah but uh <laughs> But the one one thing I'll say, like, uh, that whole red... I'm sorry, real quick, now that's got me thinking. What? Bizarro big. <laughs> big, Z big Zorro. Big Zorro. Big Zorro. Whoa. Froggy, where is my Pollywog pal? But, uh... Pollywog pal. Is he in here? Nah, just a master Master or. Or. Uh, Master Oh, yeah. shit. Oh, uh, yeah, there's, like, I want to say there's, like, three or four of those There in the are game. four of them. of them. There are four Master Ores. Uh, you take the first two to your blacksmith to get the first sword upgrade. You take the other two to the other blacksmith. Hmm, okay. Don't worry, folks. That, the, uh, other, Bizarro World's blacksmith will get, uh, will get a job again Basically, real soon. Yeah. But for now, we're heading on back to our but, work. But, wow. But, yeah, anyway. I've been they, worried about how Princess Zelda's doing. Let's get flying. Anyway, you were saying... Um, Let's do it. But it, the one thing I'll say, like, again, my favorite 
rendition of Bizarro, or my favorite thing about him was in the Red Sun comic, where basically instead of coming from Bizarro World, he was the American-made Superman, that comic. But, hmm. because he was made from Superman's DNA, even though he was like Bizarro, you know, cold breath instead of, uh, or, no, like heat breath instead of cold breath, uh, cold vision instead of heat vision, all that stuff. Oh, um, can we save that topic for another yeah. time? Because, uh, only Queen, the wife and I, we've searched everywhere for Gully. Well, at least they've had their priorities straight. But right. he's nowhere to be found. What if monsters got, no. There's no way. They just Not give up too easily. <laughs> and it really sucks that Link Tell lacks the ability to... Tell me all right, Queen. And I was saying, and it really sucks that Link lacks the ability to talk and tell them, I know where your son is. Sorry. Give me a minute, Link Queen. <laughs> hey, Man, don't you wish... You yeah, have don't you wish... This is a master or don't you? <laughs> right, business no, is always... I'm sorry, <laughs> by the way, but that whole thing kind of just... The whole bringing in or I'm just reminded of uh, the... What about Monster Hunter World? Something about Monster Hunter World series by, uh, what's his name? Terminal Montage and just, like, coming into the blacksmith and going, We, I have things! <laughs> and Let's you said life. things. Let's do it. So, with that... Hi-ho! Hmm, impressive, if I say so myself. I doubt I'll leave Intemperate Blade so fine again in my life. I mean, the harmony really? of our singing was impeccable. I know there are lots of things you gotta do. Maybe this will help you out some. And boy, howdy it will, because our Master Sword is bright hot. Oh, Ooh, it's pink. It's red. It's red. You can really feel the difference. It's red like my nose. I'm not for payment or anything, but... Give me money now. Uh, do you think you could find Gully? <laughs> Please, like, poor Link. He almost understands uh, how words work. Well, I guess I should get back to work, too. <laughs> yeah, I'll do it, little man. I know. He helped the scene out a lot. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but no, uh, that sword is my masterpiece. That blade couldn't get any sharper. No way, no how, never gonna happen at any point. Well, maybe if there was someone better at this than me, but I'm the best blacksmith in the world. Literally no one in this well, game. Fine, maybe I don't want to Fine, maybe I don't want to go to this sorry. world. I, I'm go the ahead. best blacksmith in this world. Not the other world. What other world? You didn't hear me. <laughs> Pretty <laughs> yeah, much. So, yeah. I mean, so far, we... This is definitely going to help us out big time, but for now, let's head on back to the House of Gales. House of Gales... Isn't your sword that legendary master sword or something? Yes. I heard it shoots out a beam when you're at full health. Is that right? Correct. Sounds more like a wand to me. Well, whatever gets the job done, I suppose. Okay, get on. Whoosh. Anyway, my if I right. finish the bizarro thing really quick. Yeah. Sure. What's so, that? uh, last thing. So, last thing I'll say again. The the whole my favorite bit of Bizarro is from Red Sun, where he's the American Superman, still acts like yes. Bizarro and all that. But while him and Superman are fighting, America decides to launch a nuke uh, at, at both of them after learning that they probably made something worse. And so, uh, Yay. and so, uh, like, Superman is about to go and stop the nuke. Bizarro literally punches him out of the way because even though he is Bizarro, he still has the heart of Superman and saves the world. Or, or at least he, sa he saves the... Oh. The people of this city okay. from the new. Welcome back to the Rook Kingdom. Oh, that's right. I forgot she still talks. <laughs> Not far from here is a maze built to contain the power of fire. My voice is you back to being weird. <laughs> help me. I also sent a strong presence in this vicinity. <laughs> Did you just say Don't help me? This age. Go now. Or you can help. So say I. Held on. Do I want him <laughs> now? What kind of voice you're giving him? Because I'm giving, I'm getting two kinds of vibes. One yeah, is Venom, the other is Demented Grover. I was thinking Yoda. Okay, Grover. Grover. Okay, Grover is interesting. The one I joked about is that he sounds like Darkness from Pajama Sam. Uh, oh, I forgot about him. Oh yeah. my God, yeah, like Grover cheese. Oh, that's why you said cheese crackers. <laughs> I forgot. I was wondering. I was like, why the hell did he bring up I... cheese and crackers? He doesn't sound anything like the. He doesn't sound anything like the. Hi there. I'm the. I'm the cheese. You have to say hello. I, I was uh, like, why were you saying cheese and crackers? I, I remember I, now. Go ahead, man. I was actually thinking you sound like because I made the joke. The singer of uh, the the there. Uh, the original know, singer of uh. Oh, the like, turtle. Uh, Wonderful world. Yeah. 
And I was thinking... Oh no, I got separated from my little turtles. You have to help me look for them. You just have to. You got it, clown dude from the from the freaking uh, ha Big Top Burger. Oh yeah, he does. But, that was a good. Well, well, it was. Voice. It was either that. It was either that. Or it was either that. Or he did sound like how Worth the Kids does. Palpatine, like it's perfectly sized for my little body. <laughs> There's that. I don't know. Like, th th I'm sure those are fun, but I think the one thing that always still springs to mind when I think of Worth the Kids is the whole. You potion about date. About that, 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 that we found that the youth potion's a little problematic. <laughs> problematic, <laughs> moral even. I, we have to watch. Oh, hey then... there, baby turtle. Let okay, me help uh, you help yeah. you out, out of that. Yeah. Okay. There he goes. Oh, Can no, turtle? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I was so stuck. <laughs> I didn't know what to do. Everything was upset. Really quick, uh, is it so, is it possible that is it po can turtles write themselves if they're just put like could you take a turtle that's upside down, put it in the don't... water upside down, and it could write itself? I honestly don't know. Also, I do apologize. If it's deep enough, if, it probably, if it's deep enough, they probably could. Also, that's fair. Yeah. One. Also, I do apologize. I want to do my my favorite word the kids joke of the. Uh... What it, was it just? Oh, a, um, oh no! <laughs> you seem rather busy. I should probably uh, help you out. Hey boss, you yeah, should back. try this falafel. It tastes really, it tastes really bad. Yeah, okay, thanks. I don't eat food. <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, good idea. Suddenly, <laughs> 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 yeah, no, we can let our wanna... costume slack just a little. Oh yeah, good idea. Um, anyway, uh, are we gonna take turns with all the twiddles? Uh, 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 sure, why not? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, because I was gonna. There we go. I was so terrifying. I didn't know what was I was gonna do. Elmo didn't know what Elmo was gonna do. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> you okay, Jordan? Yeah, I called the good. next turtle. Yeah, I was gonna say good because okay. you're the next turtle. I kind of know what I, you're going to do. Because I think because I, I think there's the teeniest one left. I think. I believe so. Let's look for him. Because yeah, believe it or not, the uh, the baby turtles are not of the same size, and you'll see why that's the case uh, as soon as we save them all. And yeah, no, and, and, and as far as as far as the voice that I was doing, I was honestly more inspired by that random frog we met during that. Uh, remember that one game I showed off where it was like an independent oh, Earthbound. It was like an indie yeah. Earthbound kind of game with uh, the grant with the uh, Guitar Hero like controls mm -hmm. and stuff. And there was that one tur that was there was that one frog we played a song for, and it was just like, thank you, and he just kind of hopped away. <laughs> no. It was, just, it, was, it was just random, and I really look forward to when that game comes out. <laughs> Come on, where's the other turtle? Hippity hoppity, this turtle is now my property. What? <laughs> That's just rude. You can't just do that. Fresh. <laughs> Lucky you, you. Wait, what? I was reading the caption for the silver rupee. It said "Lucky oh, yeah, yeah, you" yeah. on the very bottom. Oh, okay. No, I meant mm -hmm. I, I thought Jem said something else. Is why. Turtle, turtle. Oh, there here it go. is. Oh, look at him. He's stuck. Oh. Wait. Wait a it's minute. It's like a Maya Mai. Oh. <coughs> oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. The wall is so <laughs> sticky. It wouldn't let me go. Oh my God! Yes. How did you use that yes. kind of voice? Yes. I, love I was the trying to. You gave it. I was trying to mimic the turtle from Finding Nemo. <laughs> Oh, oh, like Chris, okay. like yeah, you got you a found snippet. All my babies. Thank you so much. I'm sorry I don't have anything I can offer you as a reward. If you need a ride somewhere, you can go ahead and hop on, though. Dead? But yeah, no, you, I remember. Dead, I am. Yes, I know. But yeah, dead, no. I would like you to be. I'd like for you to be. <laughs> but yeah, no, but yeah, I was thinking, like, and I, I did. Like, like, I'm from the EAC, dude. You got a gripping oh. ribbon and it. He's trying to say something to me. I know. Yeah, I just know. You know you're really cute, but I don't say. know what you're saying. Uh, who who voice? Okay, real quick. I know Jess Harnell does a really spot-on impression of him, but who actually plays Marlin in that movie? Oh, that's Albert Brooks. Okay, okay. Because I was say real quick. Because if you haven't already heard it, Jess Harnell does a spot-on impression of uh, Albert. He really does. Albert Brooks. Uh, it, yeah, like, I, I'll, I'll find you some clips of him. I I suggest looking up Albert Brooks in other movies. Actually, he, he is an I, amazing actor. And, and I would say, genuinely, I do think it's to such a degree where Jess Harnell is basically, like, his stand-in in any Finding Nemo thing that isn't a movie. He I is. Think so. Like, video games and stuff. Uh, yeah. yeah, he is. Also, uh... Again, Ru Save he, the Maya Maya! He <laughs> it's teasing me! Wait a second! Okay. Also, he has He's... one of my favorite voices and one of my favorite characters in all of, like... One of my favorite villains in all Thank of film. You. The, uh... Mm -hmm. I'll just say my favorite quote of his, uh... The... You know, they... There are two things they don't teach you at Harvard Law School. 
One is how to shotgun, uh, one is how to handle a shotgun, the other is how to handle defeat. I'm about to do both right now. Oh, I remember, I remember that. Is what that from movie Legally was that Blonde? From? No, that's from the Simpsons movie. Yes, oh! I, yeah, at the very end. God, I need, yeah, to, wa that, I need to watch that again. That's that turns 10 this year, doesn't it? No, yeah, that Simpsons turned movie? 10. That turned 10 in 2017. Um, oh. Yeah, wow. that movie is 14 years old. But yes, if anyone was curious, I genuinely do think, and I don't know what was going on, but I genuinely do think that the Simpsons movie was supposed to be that franchise's Spongebob it movie where really, they wanted that to be yeah. the finale. Yeah, no, it, was, it would have been a great finale. Also, my actually, my favorite line from that movie actually has to be the... Uh, That's nice. <laughs> my, my, fa my favorite line in the movie still it has to actually be the... Uh, Anyone can pick something when they know what it is. It takes real leadership to pick something you're clueless about. Okay, I pick three. Try again. One, go higher. Five. Wait, uh, five? Two high. Three? You already said three. Six? There's a six. Two? Double it. Four! As you wish, sir. Uh... <laughs> yeah. I'm selected to lead, not read. Number three. <laughs> anyway, good Rest! Stuff. Rest! I want to know, is the movie also where they had that scene with Flanders' as hot chocolate? Yes. 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 Because yes. yeah. there, there was this whole thing where he was, like, bonding with Bard, and, and, and there was the whole thing. Was like, there, 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 there was this whole thing at the end where Bard was questioning whether or not he should, like, spend his last moments with, with uh, Ned or with his dad. And, and he was like, I don't know, Dad. I mean, I, I, I just, know. I have this connection. I'll it's like, I'll let you carry the bomb. the bomb. Okay. <laughs> just hop right <laughs> over. I'll let you hold the bomb. Okay. Like I, I say, say he knows me. I also just say that because I also just think back to like just that scene in particular after he makes it, Bard gets it, climbs down the tree, drinks it. Oh my god! Oh yeah! yeah, yeah. Oh, you're talking, you're I, talking about the Babish episode. Yeah. Also, I love that. Oh, yeah. yeah. Also, really quick before we leave, I think one of my other favorite quotes from that movie is at the end where it's like, uh, "Dad, I'm sorry. Don't. It's all right, son. I wasn't a great father. Maybe it was the way of my father treated me. Wait, I realize it now." Yes, it's just all been one cycle of SOMEBODY THROW THE GODDAMN BOMB! <laughs> like, just, like, forget about the emotional moment, get rid of the anime. Good movie, genuinely do recommend that. Uh, wh however, it is an amazing the writing film. is gone right now, it is still really good. Yeah, uh, yeah. so James, so James, uh, we're going into that lava-infested death pit? Yes, to see how Siwi's doing. See you all oh. next time. Alright, that's it. Goodbye! It'll happen to me, it'll happen to you!